Hey students, this is to go over in experiment one, your data observations quiz, data sheets, um, how to use a math equation editor. It's different from the classic quizzes. So when I go down to question number nine, it wants me to do a percent difference, which requires a fraction. If I go to the math quill, which is what's on the new Canvas quizzes versus the classic Canvas quizzes, which had the equation editor. When you click on this, one of the things you notice is they don't have the fraction button anymore. So that's a little confusing, but everything else is the same. They actually eliminated the fraction button because they made it where, let's say I wanted to do the fraction three halves. You can just use a uh, backslash to do that. So I could hit three and the backslash is basically um, right next to the question. It's the question mark button. So you could hit backslash and it automatically puts it into a fraction and then you hit two. So right there, I have my fraction. Now, when I hit done, what's confusing is I get this like latex format. Now, basically this is code for a fraction. And this is very confusing. So the first thing I want to tell you is you can work around this. So let's say this was your percent difference. We can hit percent difference equals, and then you can type underneath it and do, this is my answer, this is it. But it still doesn't look like a fraction. What you actually have to do is you have to submit, you have to submit this test. So once you submit it, telling me you know because i didn't complete it but once you submit this test and if i scroll down and i look it actually now doesn't put it in the latex format it shows it in fraction form so that is really confusing but i just wanted to lay that out there so it makes sense i hope this helps